size has been a big factor in this fight, as I see right here. That right, speed belongs to Pacquiao. Pacquiao flirts with the corner there, then moves away. Now his back is against the ropes. Margarito tries to press the action. Pacquiao hits a bluff with a big left hand. And then Flurry under his right eye. So Pacquiao can do that. Yeah, Margarito's saying that Pacquiao's not hurting him, but his face is telling a different story. Indeed. He's not as physically strong and has to do this rather than just he heard bully him with a body Margarito around good, the ring. But yeah. he's beating Margarito up in this round. There's shot. a huge rope under Margarito's right eye. He's backing Margarito up, and he's hurting him. You can see it possibly going to 12 round decision. Pacquiao fighting back with his back on the ropes. And here comes And he Manny. turns it around and bangs yeah. Margarito dishes it. Draw your own conclusions. I talked to Miguel earlier today. Miguel said this was going to be a very tough fight. As I was telling him, I thought that Pacquiao I had to edge. He said, man, he may have edge, but it's going to be a hard fight. Which is a little better than a smaller guy. But a regular 140-pounder, I think man would have not. The athletic commission to make Margarito shave off the beard, which probably they would have done. Pacquiao said, leave it there. I want to use it as a target. Physically fatigued both. And this uh, what right hook. That's what he he he's saw ready to didn't see yeah. it coming. That was a right hook from Pacquiao. Yeah. Hopelessly behind to no, get it. No head movement at all. Landed a shot, looked towards. He's out being out punched, but the referee has to wait have a few more seconds to focus on. he's rearranging Margarito's face. If the referee stopped, it wouldn't be any complaint, but I just don't think.